Look, gang, Carolina Jackpot time coming at you. It's Friday evening. It's almost five o'clock. Hope everyone's wrapping up their work week. And if not, well, then uh, I certainly hope that tomorrow goes well for you at work. Um, just cruising around here and thinking about something that I, uh, I actually let, let me preface this by saying I actually got the idea for this video from um, some sports talk here in the upstate of South Kakalaki. Uh, yesterday afternoon and I actually was gonna make this video yesterday afternoon but I didn't um, so anybody who wants to jump in the comment section say well I know what Carolina Jackpot was in into on Thursday afternoon usually hear stuff like that from people around this area then uh, okay yes I did I got that uh, idea from uh, that particular radio show in your upstate but um, <clears throat> anyway uh, Stetson Bennett um, does this guy, does he hate uh, Georgia? Does he hate the University of Georgia? Hate the Georgia football team and the Georgia football fans? I think he may. And um, this past weekend's activities kind of, um, kind of solidified that. Now, Make no mistake about it. I am not in any means when I'm talking about last weekend. Uh, it's, it's, it's a totally separate incident. What happened uh, with those young folks uh, after uh, the, uh, the the national championship celebration, Georgia fans. So don't be warming up any tar and feathers for me because I'm not going to uh, mention that. I, I just think that's absolutely awful. Uh, and heart goes out to their families and everything. I mean, you know, that that's just. I mean, I. You know, who would he could even imagine him thinking about football after that? I, I don't know. Um, I, I could not. Um, but, but things have to go on, um, obviously, for the football program and that. But uh, keep that in mind. This is totally separate from there. But anyway, Stetson Bennett during that, uh, that parade, I was like very disinterested and and not engaging at all. I went back and watched these videos and kind of kind of looked at the you know, what was going on there. He's not not engaged in it. He's not looking at the fans. We're not shaking hands and kissing babies. We're looking at our freaking phone. I mean, my man's over here crushing some candy, or uh, you know, on the on the Wish app, or he's. Uh, you know, hooking up on Tinder. Or, I mean, I don't know what's going on over there. But he's not, uh, he was not engaging with anyone. Did not like he was happy to be there. Gave a very uh, less than uh, thrilling uh, speech. I mean, I just think the guy just hates Georgia. I really do. And I think uh, that the successes that you folks found last year and this year uh, that wouldn't have happened if he hadn't been your quarterback. And that's the thing about it. The, see, here's the thing. You didn't want him to be your quarterback. You did not want him to be your quarterback. You definitely didn't want him to be your quarterback in 2020. Okay? Everybody thought Jamie Newman was the guy. Okay? We thought Jamie Newman was the guy. We got, well, then he turns out he don't even, he doesn't even play. He, he leaves the program. Uh, Hell, I can't remember what happened to the guy. Did he get injured? I think he had some kind of injury, maybe. Anyway, he was a non-factor. You wanted him to be the man. He he left. He's gone. Right. Uh, so then we, you know, you wanted Dwan Mathis to be the guy. You want him to be the guy. Well, then he gets hurt, and then, and they have to turn. Yeah, they got to turn to Stetson. You know, well, what is this? And you're laughing at this guy. You're laughing at me. Yeah, he's making mistakes. He made some mistakes. Yeah, and then. Um, you know, you want JT Daniels. You want JT Daniels to be the guy, um, and 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 he plays okay. Um, but you know, I, I think Stetson Bennett uh, kind of got the uh, the brunt uh, of the excuse making for Georgia not winning uh, that 2020 uh, SEC East Championship. And I know that's stuck in your crawl. That's stuck in your crawl that uh, that old Dan Mullen went out there and won the SEC East in 2020. That was just a magical year for him. Uh, all the stars came into alignment. Uh, that that will probably be uh, very rare if it ever happens again. If you'll find someone uh, like a Kyle Trask to be as good of a quarterback as he was, and nobody knew that was going to happen, and um, you know 
he, he, he finds his, his favorite target there in Kyle Pitts. Everybody knew he was a good player. Um, and, uh, you know, it, they just caught lightning in a bottle uh, with that deal. Um, but I think that he gets blamed a lot for, for not winning that. There's, and uh, then, you know, 2021 rolls around. We think that, that we think that, J, that JT Daniels is guy. We want JT Daniels to be the guy. But he's not. He gets hurt. He's often hurt. And Justin Minnett has to step back in there then. And he, he bails you out. Um, and, you know, what do you get? Does he get a lot of accolades for it? No, he doesn't. I don't think he gets Saints for it. No. What does he get? Just criticism uh, of his game. Criticism of his game from the Georgia fans. I mean, it's just, it's it's ridiculous. I mean, I mean, come on, guy. I mean, it's, it's like... They don't want that, or they never wanted to look at what this guy was doing well. They just wanted to look at what he could do better, or what what he wasn't doing well. I, I don't get it, and and he knows that, and he feels it, and he felt it from social media, and um, I, I think the hatred started to grow in 2020, and then it spilled over into 2021, and it became full blown. And people are motivated to do things that they normally wouldn't be able to do for some, like, some strange reasons. I mean, some of them are, and some not so strange reasons. Some of it's by greed. Uh, some of it's by money. Some of it by sex. Uh, some of it by um, I, any number of factors. Revenge. Anger. I think anger fueled him to lead you people to that national championship in 2021. And you're going to sit there and say, well, 15 defensive draft picks on the blah, 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 didn't have nothing to do with it. Yes, it did. But you got to have a quarterback. You got to have you got to have a straw that stirs the drink. You got to have a straw that stirs the drink. You got to have the guy to drive the bus. You got to. Or you ain't winning shit. Bring that to 2022. I, I mean, that hatred he boiled over even more. And, and then he was bound to determine more than ever. That Missouri game, that Missouri game, you people were dead in the, you were dead in the water. He didn't play very well that game. Still led you to come find victory. Still won. Um, that you you should not have won that game. Nobody else would have won that game. I don't think the other quarterback would have won that game for you. So. Um, I, I don't think this. I think Stetson Bennett hates Georgia. Uh, I think he hates the fans, uh, or most of them. And uh, I'm not even so sure that he uh, doesn't hate the coaching staff, too. I mean, it's just like nobody believed in him, and they still don't. And they still don't. None of you even believe that he's even worthy of, of being like even like a late level uh, or late round pick uh, in the NFL draft. And that's just ridiculous. It really is. He doesn't have the talent. He didn't have the arm. He didn't have this. He had to do it in college. Well, NFL requires a different skill set. You know, well, you know what? Um, he played at a pretty high level in college. I think he'd probably be all right. I think he'd probably be all right. I don't think Tom Brady was ever highly thought of in uh, in college going into the draft either, was he? Nah. I don't think Tony Romo was either. Huh? Nah. 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 But it, it can't happen for him. It can't happen for him. So don't worry about it, Georgia fans. Don't worry about saying that he's going to be a, uh, a a very late round draft pick. You know why? Because you already made him your very late round quarterback at the University of Georgia. It's sad. We hate you. And kind of has reason to. I has a reason to. I'll see you guys later. Appreciate it. Peace. And I'm out of here. Go Gamecocks and go Coach Beamer. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Woo!